the wind energy module in clean energy desktop okay here we're going to analyze a, uh, a wind turbine anywhere from one kilowatt uh, all the way up to three thousand kilowatts or three megawatts uh, we'll look at the value the payback uh, and the clean energy applications that these wonderful uh, uh, power generators uh, offer let's start with a, a size we'll go for a larger unit about fourteen hundred and fifty uh, kilowatts Next, we're going to set the baseline conditions for this particular uh, generator. Power density. This is the uh, percent of actual nameplate capacity that's used, depend and, and that depends on the wind quality at the site. Uh, it can range anywhere from 25 to 75 percent. In this example, we'll set it at about 40 percent, 41 percent of nameplate capacity utilization for this particular uh, application. Next, we uh, choose the capital cost, or the installed capital cost, which can range anywhere from $1,000 up to $10,000 per kilowatt, depending upon the size. The uh, larger size units, like this 1,450 uh, kilowatt example, would be typically lower, somewhere between $1,500 and uh, maybe $1,800. I'll pick $1,600, $1,700 per kilowatt of capital cost. Uh, moving down the baseline conditions, there are a couple additional settings that we want to make. Next would be the value of the power generated. Uh, so in this case, I'll set the value of the power generated at 10 cents per kilowatt hour. And lastly, for baseline, we set up the annual maintenance and operating costs. In this example, I'll use 4% or about $98,000 per year. OK, we've got the baseline set up. Let's run the analysis, hit the button, and we see that this is a $2.4 $2 million installation that generates 5.1 uh, million kilowatt hours per year at a value of about five hundred and fifteen thousand dollars. The payback is five point nine million. Uh, excuse me, five point nine years, uh, offsetting or saving thirty two hundred and eighty uh, thirty two hundred eighty two metric tons per year of CO two. If uh, this power was backing out uh, oil generation on the grid, it would uh, back out three thousand barrels per year of uh, imported oil. The uh, unit produces fifty one hundred almost uh, fifty one hundred fifty seven. Uh, renewable energy credits and right now the value of uh, the clean energy credits are zero because we haven't set that up so remember this we're at 5.9 now let's go to tab number two clean energy credits uh, we'll take 30 percent uh, tax credit federal tax credit on the capital invested in this particular unit for renewable energy credits we'll value those uh, in this example at about uh, seventy dollars uh, per rec and then lastly we'll set the CO2 value we'll set the CO2 value at about uh, fifteen sixteen dollars per per ton okay let's go back to the uh, tab number one and with the clean energy credits applied let's reanalyze this wind turbine and there's a big improvement you can see we go in from 5.9 year payback to two year payback which is really good for a two and a half million dollar uh, power generation investment um, we have the benefit of four hundred and twenty three thousand dollars per year of rec and co2 credits in, in addition to the uh, thirty percent uh, capital tax credit so you can see this is a very good project and uh, offers a lot of uh, promise and that's why so many uh, thousands of megawatts of these units are being installed uh, at each year.